In this session, we're going to look at creditors, close creditors period. This option will close a date up to a certain period. In other words, you're locking a period so that users are not allowed to work with that date and before the date that you've selected. This option is not a month end. This option will prevent users from making mistakes when it comes to selecting dates. Be very careful when you select a date. I am now busy in the 2012 financial year. So if my 2011 financial year is complete, all the tra transactions has been processed, the auditors have adjusted and made all the transactions, I can close a previous financial year. Just keep in mind that you will never be able to process a transaction on this date or before this date. What is nice about this option is next year when the 2012 financial year is finished, I can then close the transaction. This is not a must, but this is a preventative option to avoid making mistakes in a period that should not have extra transactions processed within it because everything has been finished off for that financial year. And that concludes looking at closed creditors period.